My first experience with meth was when I was 19. I started prostituting and I was homeless for 13 years. And I stayed on the streets until I entered Crossroads. From that day, I got clean. I had a visit with my daughter and from then on out, I fought. I fought for the beautiful life that I have now. I wanted it so bad because I was tired of being cold and hungry. I started at River House and then I went to the cottages and I struggled a little bit when I got there, but I had to have a talk with myself. If you want that beautiful girl back, you have to do it. Being reunified with my daughter was incredible. I went through pushing her out, giving her up, and getting her back. I can conquer the world now. I got a job with TSA in 2005. I was smoking a lot of pot. That was a daily thing. And I had to give up the pot working for the government. So I turned to the alcohol. When I got off work, I was drinking like a pint of Captain Morgan's a day. I was living in Pennsylvania with a friend for a couple of years and drinking heavily. And uh, my friend started beating me. I uh, called my friend that lives out here in Reno and uh, asked her if there were jobs and shelters. She said yes. So I called my brother in San Diego. He flew me out here and I went to our place. I became friends with Willis. They kept talking about crossroads and I don't know if I was ready, but Willis said, I got a phone call and it was crossroads and they said, you're coming in. I went to detox for a few days and been sober ever since. I started doing good in the program. When it got time to graduate, they talked to me about becoming the activities director and possibly a house mom. I agreed to that and so they moved me to Jane Aubrey to be a house mom there. I'm very proud of myself. If it wasn't for Crossroads, I don't know where I'd be. My name is Portia and I'm two and a half years clean. My name is Molly Sears, I'm 63 years old and I've been sober for over one year. Addiction is real and recovery is possible.